in this video we have been given that a b c d is a square and d e is one and radius of d circle is two then we have to find side of d square so we have a b c d it is a square that means a b it will be equal to b c it will be equal to c d and it will be equal to d a suppose x so a b is x b c is x c d is x and d a is x and now suppose the center of the circle is o this point is p this point is q and this point is m then in any circle radius and tangent they are perpendicular to each other so this angle it will be 90 degree and this angle it will be 90 degree and also op it will be equal to oq that is radius so it will be 2 oq it will be 2 and abcd it is a square so this angle it will be 90 degree and now in aq op it is a q o p this angle is 90 degree this angle is 90 degree and this angle is 90 degree so this angle it will be also 90 degree and we have op is equal to oq that is 2 that means aq op it will be a square so aq it will be qo it will be op it will be pa that will be 2 so pa it is 2 and aq is 2 and we have ab is x and ab is aq plus qb it is x and aq is 2 plus qb it is x so qb it will be x minus 2 qb it will be x minus 2 and we have ad is x and ad is ap plus pe plus ed it is x and ap is 2 plus pe plus ed is 1 it is x and it is 3 plus pe is x so pe it will be x minus 3 pe it will be x minus 3 and now in any circle 
from any point P if we make two tangent on the circle. Suppose this point is A and this point is B, then PA it will be equal to PB, PA it will be equal to PB. So here from point E, EP it will be equal to EM, EP it will be equal to EM and EP is x minus 3 so EM it will be x minus 3 EM it will be x minus 3 and from point B BQ it will be equal to BM and BQ is x minus 2 so BM it will be also x minus 2 and now in triangle EAB it is E A B E A it is x minus 3 plus 2 that will be x minus 1 A B is x and E B it is x minus 3 plus x minus 2 that will be 2 x minus 5 and this angle is 90 degree so a e square plus a b square it will be e b square and a e is x minus 1 square plus a b is x square it is equal to e b is 2 x minus 5 square and it is x square plus 1 square minus 2 times x times 1 plus x square is equal to and this will be 2x square plus 5 square minus 2 times 2x times 5 and it is x square plus 1 minus 2x plus x square is equal to 4x square plus 25 minus 2 times 2x times 5 it will be 20x and x square plus x square it will be 2x square minus 2x plus 1 it is equal to 4x square minus 20x plus 25 and 4x square minus 2x square it will be 2x square and minus 20x plus 2x it will be minus 18x and 25 minus 1 will be 24 it is equal to 0 and we can take 2 common and it will be x square minus 9x plus 12 is 0 so x square minus 9x plus 12 it will be equal to 0 and for equation ax square plus bx 
plus c is equal to 0, x is minus b plus minus a square root of b square minus 4ac by 2a and here a is 1, b is minus 9 and c is 12. So x it will be equal to minus of minus 9 plus minus a square root of minus 9 a square minus 4 times 1 times 12 by 2 times a is 1 and x is equal to 9 plus minus a square root of 81 minus 48 by 2 and x is equal to 9 plus minus a square root and 81 minus 48 it will be 33 by 2 so we get x is 9 plus a square root of 33 by 2 and x is 9 minus a square root of 33 by 2 and now we know that a square root of 33 it is greater than 5 so 9 minus a square root of 33 it will be less than 4 and 9 minus a square root of 33 by 2 it will be less than 2 and from this figure we can say that x should be greater than 2 x should be greater than 2 that means x cannot be equal to 9 minus a square root of 33 by 2 so x will be equal to 9 plus a square root of 33 by 2 so side of d square it is 9 plus a square root of 33 by 2 